Oh, those are sunglasses. Those are the sunnies. <laughs> um, so we have arrived in Kotu. We got up this morning, got a bullet train. We stayed in the capital hotel last night, so we were very rough this morning after New Year's Eve. So we didn't film getting here. So um, it was uneventful. Caught a bullet train. Um, so we're in Kyoto now. We just caught the train to Ashuramana, <laughs> which is essentially the heritage area of Kyoto, although generally Kyoto is pretty traditional um, architecture anyway. And we're heading to the bamboo forest. And we've already done a bit of shopping. <laughs> So we made it to the bamboo forest. Wouldn't say it's a forest, more of like a walkway, but um, still very cool. Get all the Instagrams. Um, since you're in Kyoto anyway, it's not too far away, so it's still worth going to. And it's free. We are walking up this massive hill. It says it's supposed to be a 20 minute walk to get up to. Awarashima Monkey Park. You say things a lot better than I do, you should all the talking. <laughs> <laughs> We're taking ourselves to make a, a personal challenge to get up here in under 20 minutes. I'm excited to see the little monkeys. I love monkeys. This is still in the same area of Kayeto, just across the river. Show me angry. Angry monkey. Show me angry monkey, show me scared monkey. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> Arashiyama monkey park. Got some banana. So we made it to the top in about 15-ish minutes, so we still beat the 20. Um, and then they have this rest area inside a cage, which is for the humans, which is why I wanted to come to this park because. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Um, yeah, so the reason I want to come to this monkey park um, rather than a zoo is because the monkeys aren't made to be here, they just come down from the mountain, and the humans are in the cages, not the monkeys. And then you put my food, and we bought some banana, and yeah, so we're gonna go feed some monkeys. I'll get it. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I think that's the safe way to do it. Are you nice? Are you really nice? Yeah, I'm greedy. I've got two more. Oh no. Oh. So I can't meant to do that. <laughs> mm. 
So you're on top of this mountain with all these monkeys and it's a crazy view of Kyoto. So we're on our way down now. Um, it was so much fun. It was way better than I thought it would be. I was like, yeah, I've seen monkeys, but they're so funny. They're so much fun. There's always a crazy one and then there's beef and you can look at the one sitting there just watching all the drama. It's great. I think I've had, and like their little hands grab, like yeah, that was crazy. Very delicate. It's obviously very useful. Mm, like, obviously I know about evolution, but it really like cements it, like in a way that a textbook can't. And I got a million photos. Um, much excited about it. Seven dollars to get in. And then it was like $1.20 for the food. <laughs> now we're gonna go to Guyon and see if we can find some geishas. Geishas? Geisha. Geishas. It's getting cold and we're staying at a guest house tonight so we might just go hang out there and check that out. So we just checked into our guest house in Japan and it is so cute. We're staying at the guest house Uraki um, in Kyoto and it's amazing. You don't even see the room yet. Yeah, we... Looks cool, That's hey? Cool. Into it. <laughs> That's so good. Well, I'm glad we're cool, hey? We're back. That's where we're going tomorrow. So in one side of the room we have our tatakshi mat, which is where we can eat and have a little dining set, some TV that we can't watch because it's in Japanese. And then we have two beds because that's the tradition in Japan is separate beds. And then over here, excuse all of our stuff, but we have the section down there to put your shoes and they supplied some slippers. And then we have a little fridge, toiletries, all that stuff. And then a little humidifier, which I've been sick, so I definitely need that and some tissues. How did they know? It's compact, but got everything you need. This is the same as our last apartment. This seems like it's a normal showers in Japan. It's like bath shower combo. And we have a toilet, which is robotic. Um, best part about this is that it has a heated toilet seat, which, oh my gosh, didn't know I needed it until I had it. Toiletries, is that a hairbrush? Give me a fold around hairbrush. Safety razor, if they have tweezers, that would be small toothbrushes. Also, also if they got cotton, I need a pair of tweezers, that would have been helpful. And all that soaps. And me. I'm looking rough after today. It's been a long one. I'm still on about five hours sleep from New Year's Eve, and I can't believe how much stuff we got through today. And we walked around, saw the monkeys. We found this temple in. We were trying to find the geishas. We couldn't find them because they were closed. Try something else tomorrow, but. It was too much today. We were too tired after such a big day and a big night. Before I let you go, I have to do a bed test. Everything looks great, but how comfortable is it? Most of the beds in Japan so far have been pretty rough, like stiff. They're like a stiff bed here. Ooh. <laughs> this is so comfortable. Oh my gosh. This is so squishy. That's it for today. Kyoto is great, but my biggest complaint is transport takes ages to get everywhere, so it's hard to fit everything in and not waste heaps of time. But tomorrow we're going to do a big day again, because every day is a big day when you're traveling with me. you got to fit it all in. Tomorrow we're going to try again for some geishas. Go to the Tory Gates and the Gold Palace, which none of those are the right names, but hopefully you know what I mean. <laughs> Okay, thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe so I can see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Hey, it's Vet from the future. Just wanted to drop in at the end of this video just to let you know that I have just launched my first blog, website, whatever, hub for everything for me. So click the link in the description. 
if I can put a link in the cards, I will. I don't know how skilled I am. Go over, check it out, let me know. I've spent so long um, putting this together. I got it designed and I'm slowly going through and putting in all this information um, in regards to my current travels. So China and Japan, which is this series, and then also um, going back and getting all of these places, everything I know about all of those um, on the blog. So I get a lot of questions constantly about um, what things to do, best times to go, my experiences of certain things. So I thought I was just gonna put blog posts up of each of these things um, and then that way I can link them out if anyone gives has any questions you have you can go and find it for yourself or you can still ask me go over check it out let me know bye back to the video